This is the Las Vegas Sun Super 7, our preseason All-City team. I'm here with the sophomore Addison Carr from Bishop Gorman. The history of Super 7, there's only been a handful of sophomores. We're talking like Troy Brown, NBA, Julian Strother, NBA type of names. So, Uncharted Waters, congratulations. Um, so, I, I've seen you play maybe one and a half times, but probably some of our, our, our audience hasn't seen you play. Uh, describe your game. What do you do? Uh, um, I'm a very multi-dimensional player. I run the floor very well. I play defense. I do basically whatever coach asks us to do. I can hit an open shot. I can attack the lanes when needed. So, yeah. Uh, are you a – would you rather have a game-winning assist, nice pass, or would you have a, rather have a game-winning shot? Personally, like, as long as we win the game. <laughs> like, I really don't – I would love to hit the shot, but I would love – if my teammate the shot, you know, I love to cheer on my teammates and I would love to make the shot in the play myself. So as long as we win the game. Yeah. Uh, so Bishop Gorman, rich tradition. Mm -hmm. It's been around for decades and decades. A lot of teams have won state. Um, how, how was it to know that you had a, a hand in helping a, a school with such a rich tradition add to that, to that success? Um, it was, it was amazing. Just the feeling of coming in freshman year and knowing that I had to do what I needed to do in order for us to win state. And I know my teammates all made me better. I helped to make them better. And that's why we were able to win. Yeah, when I was a kid, the freshmen all played on the ninth grade team. I know. So it's even making varsity is like, it should be at the top of the resume. Um, so do you play other sports or are you the only basketball player? I'm the only basketball. What about when you were five? Did you play oh, like team ball? Or... I played soccer all the way up until the eighth grade. Okay. I played volleyball school i did track okay. softball okay. i did it all if you're not at basketball practice yeah. or running the track or mm -hmm. doing whatever what do you like to do for fun um i hang out with my friends a lot we'll go to the volleyball games and support our women's volleyball team uh we have a lot of sleepovers and we go shopping okay we eat food. okay uh favorite class at gorman and the teacher that inspired me <laughs> um my favorite class at gorman right now it's probably ceramics because it's a very hands-on class, and it's I just enjoy it. It's fun. It's different. I'm not writing things down with a pen and paper. And the teacher that inspires me the most, um, I probably say it's my English teacher from last year, Mrs. Silver. She was a very realistic person, and when I what I mean by that is that she taught me a lot of life lessons, and I feel like I benefited a lot from her. Did you tell her that? I have. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's good. Uh, favorite type of music? What kind of music do you? I listen to a lot of R and B, Party Next Door, like, Drake. Okay, uh, I've listened to R and B as a kid, but yeah. more like LL Cool J, Belle Dip DeVoe, who yeah. your coach might have known. But uh, um, favorite type of food? If you're gonna have your, you That's know, hard. a birthday dinner, where would it be? Or I just what like. Would it be? I love steak. I just like steak and Italian food. I like good pasta. Okay, so you can never go wrong with that. Alrighty, well, Super Seven, Addison Carr. Could be a three-time Super 7, which would be a record. I know. That'd be amazing. All right. Thank, thank you, you for so having me. Yes, ma'am.